I'm Nicole Griffin with the latest headlines from WRTV. A quick thinking nine year old boy is reunited with his mother after jumping out of a stolen pickup truck on Indianapolis's west side. Metro police say the black pickup was stolen from 10th and King with the child inside. Police say the thief pulled over on Albany Street and that is when the boy jumped out of the truck and ran to a nearby house for help. Police say the thief also darted out of the truck, ran down the street and stole another car that was idling at a gas station. Police say there is a lesson we can all learn from this. We realize it's cold out, but please, please, please do not leave your vehicles running and unlocked. And definitely don't leave any children unattended. Detectives are now reviewing video and trying to track down the suspect. If you have any information, call Metro Police or Crime Stoppers at 317-262-TIPS. Covering COVID in Indiana, hospitalizations continue to decline and many COVID restrictions are starting to ease up. We spoke with Dr. Ram Yaletti with Community Health Network who says they are seeing a dramatic drop in hospitalizations over the past two to three weeks. He says the hospitals are still near capacity, but many of the patients being treated now are for non COVID or flu related reasons. Right now, his staff is treating about 60 COVID patients. That is compared to more than 200 just weeks ago. He says it's an encouraging sign and he doesn't expect to see another surge from the Omicron variant. Omicron just seems to have this really steep rise and then a steep drop. And it probably is related to the fact of how contagious it is. So we probably had a large number of people getting infected really, really fast, like a large number. So when you have so many people infected, the, the virus just didn't have that many more places to go. Dr. Yaletti says it is now reasonable to try to get back to reducing how intense we are when it comes to masking up and other COVID restrictions.